Hey guys, it's time for my weekly um, cash out. And if you want to see how much Miss um, V is taking back to the bank from using my credit cards and um, using money out of my buffer, stay tuned. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? In today's video, I will be doing my weekly um, cash out. I used to do this a while back and I just started back doing it because I started back using my credit card and using my debit card some. So what this is, um, I am an all cash budgeter, but sometimes I use my debit card or my credit card. And I need to um, take the money out of these uh, um, cash accounts and take the money back to the bank to satisfy you know, the, the money that I took out of my account. Because I um, keep a certain amount of money in my um, checking account. That's what we call a buffer or a cushion. Because I am on this journey. I'm married, but my husband's not on this part of the journey. This is something I chose to do because I would like to retire early. So I leave most of the money in the bank. And just take a portion out to share with you guys here on my video. So in today's video, we're going to be cashing out money. Taking back to the bank money that I... Um, took out of my buffer account or by using my debit card or either my, I don't think I use my credit card this time. I mostly use my debit card. So let's go ahead and get started. So I have everything wrote down. That's what I did last week. Last week I had to take $565 back to the bank. And I also, well, I didn't get to share on the video, but I transferred $392 in digital funds. So I also share that part too on my, um, weekly cash stuffing but this week I don't have to um transfer any money digitally so let's go ahead and get started so I went to Aldi and picked up some things so I I need to um I got some candles and a rug and some more things but the um things that came out of home totaled up to fifty dollars so I'm gonna go ahead and take the fifty dollars out of my home account so I hope you guys are having a great day I really like um this cash envelope system stay tuned i got a video coming up just sharing with you how much this system has really changed me i didn't realize it until i just took some time off and just sat back and just thought about how i've changed since starting this cash envelope system in april of 2021 so 10 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 so we got to get some change somewhere so let me see if i can find some change so I need a change for a hundred because I gotta get um fifty dollars. So I'm gonna go in my Miss V on law. I know I gotta change for a hundred in here. So I got twenty. I need some ten. So I need oops, twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, and one hundred. Then I put this hundred back that came out of home. Put that back in Miss V on low. And okay, this is What did I just do? I think I missed it. Let me see, how much does home supposed to have? Okay, let me take the 50 out for home first. 50, this is what I'm paying myself back and this is what I'm supposed to put back in home. So home is supposed to have a total of, got 225 minus 50, 225 50, so I should have 175. So I know I'm put 175 back in home. One, so I messed up somewhere, 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 77, 172, 73, 74, 75. Okay, 175 goes back in home. Let me update my tracker. Let me figure out. Um, today is the 15th. So I subtracted $50. So it's 175. So I guess that, um, I gotta go with Miss V then. Yeah. I think I just didn't put it back. Miss V's supposed to have 372, 1, 2, 220, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 3, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 1, 2. Yeah, that's it. Okay, yeah. So we got that. So I got my $50 from home. We're going to highlight this. Saying that I took the money back to the bank. As you can see, I got some already highlighted. I went ahead and did that that day. And okay, so that's fifty dollars. So that's all in this binder. 
So next we're gonna go to my apartment binder. If you've been following me, yay, Miss V put a um deposit on a um apartment finally. Well, it's the same apartment building because I just went back to them because I had already paid $50 application fee and I asked her how long is my application good for she said 90 days so she said she really won't have anything available till the end of September but she got like some you know some um updating going on with two different um apartment complexes one of them is right next to the hospital that I work and the other one is two blocks behind the hospital where I work I just told her whichever one is available first so yeah, so I went ahead and secured it with my deposit. She said I'll be the first one to be able to um get one since I already paid my deposit. So we're gonna take 250 out of here, one, two, 220, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51. So we're gonna take all that out. So yeah, so hopefully we can um get the apartment. Cause the hotel is killing me financially. Not where I'm in a buying, but it just it it just makes more sense to get an apartment, in my opinion. All right, so we got that 251 for the depart department, not me apartment deposit, and also we are gonna go to my family buying. My daughter Erica owes me ten dollars, so let me take her ten dollars out, cause baby, she just trying to find her way. I'm helping as much as I can. I can only help so much. I like my kids to find their own way. That way you appreciate it more. So let me find, oh, her bind, hers is not in here. Wrong binder. That's what happened when you had too many binders. I forgot I put her back in here. So I'm gonna take her out. So her $10 that she owed me. I already updated the tracker. So next we have, when I did go to, um. All these, I picked up some candles, but I only had five dollars in the candle um, envelope, so I'm gonna take that five dollars out, and the rest of it I took out when I got that fifty out of home, because the candles is for the home. So five dollars. Yeah, I love me some candles. I gotta build this back up. See, Bath and Body Works having a sale, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I gotta stay focused. Okay, that's that five dollars for the candles. And then last, I just ordered from a couple of small businesses. I don't know how much that other one well i ordered from one small business the other one hadn't gave me the total so i'm just gonna go ahead and take this 21 dollars out of this one and i'll do the other one next week small businesses i'm so glad i did this envelope because sometimes i'd be wanting 21 dollars i'm just gonna do i'm just gonna do 20. um sometimes i'd be wanting to support businesses but i don't need anything else so what i do is just do like a giveaway yeah, so that's it. That's all the money we got going back to the bank this week. Let's see how much we got. I didn't use my credit card this week. Not for this. We got 100, 100, well, I thought I had another 100. Come on, Miss V, get together. 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 310, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36. $236 going back to the bank, so yeah. So that's it, that's gonna conclude this video. This is Miss V, I'm gonna continue to show you love and I'm gonna always help you save on some of the things you need so you can get some of the things you want. Thank you. And have a nice day. Go follow me on Instagram. And I'm also on TikTok. Yeah. Check me out. Check me out.